What about the whole debate? We spoke to Cafu, the Brazil captain who won the last World Cup, last time they did it, 2002. He said Messi and Ronaldo, neither of them can be called great until they win a World Cup. Do you agree with that? Yeah, I mean, that's kind of the old adage. You know, that's kind of the same thing that we face back home in the NBA. It's like, you can't be considered an all-time great until you win the NBA championship. Who's better, Messi or Ronaldo? Well, I think for the last five years, Messi's been the best player in the world. And I think this year, Ronaldo's really taking his game to another level, to a point where you can consider him the best in the world at the moment. Uh, but you, all, you always know Messi is lurking in the corner. And you know he can explode at any given time. Uh, I do think Neymar is going to be the player that carries the next generation, though. And if one of them needs a World Cup to be great, does the same apply for LeBron back home right now? Well, yeah, I mean, but he has two of them, right? And, um, you know, for us players, it really becomes about how many you get, which sounds absolutely ridiculous, right? Because it's, you know, you're, you're really lucky and fortunate to win one. But now it's become so jaded that it's like, okay, you only won one or you only won two. You should win five or six, which is absolutely ridiculous. Um, but nonetheless, I mean, that's the challenge that we deal with. Cheering on the United States this tournament, presumably? Of course, of course, of course. We all know about your European background. Italiano, Italiano. Italy v the United States in the final, who you be cheering on? <laughs> I got, I gotta go with USA. But 